If you look at Denali, in just in terms of the value, the economic value that we bring to, to South Africa, okay, in terms of our exports and the foreign exchange that we bring into the country, it's almost 1.7 billion rand annually. Okay. In terms of a company of this magnitude and its contribution to research and development, okay, specifically, and that includes client funded, okay, it's almost 530 million that we spend. And of that, 130 million is self funded, okay. And remember, when we talk about these figures here, the 130 million comes straight off the bottom line. But as you are aware of the fact that over the last few years, Denel has gone through a very difficult period, you know, for a number of reasons, and, and, and that range from uh, the economic difficulties that, that were faced not only locally but internationally as well, the downturn in the international economy, the pressures on the defense budget within South Africa as well, and for right reasons, because of the reprioritization of defense spending and towards more social spending. So Tenel went through a very difficult period uh, for a number of years. As you are aware of the fact that in the last year, not this last financial year, financial year before that, it posted a small profit. And we were, we were quite convinced that at that point, if we made the right interventions, we could create a sustainable future for Tenel. And we believe that with the kind of interventions we have made in the last 18 months or so, that we are well on our way to becoming a sustainable business, contributing significantly, not only to the defense of this country, which is our primary and core business, but to the general developmental imperatives of South Africa. Okay? So what did we do? We secured on, uh, we focused on securing new revenue growth, entering new markets, diversification of our product lines into new environments as well, and to find a different business model of how we conduct business, not only locally but internationally as well. And that centered a lot around the establishment of strategic partnerships and leveraging the technology to influence and optimize those partnerships. And, and I'm pleased to say that, you know, for at least the next five to seven years that we've built up an order book of 21 billion rand already, okay? That in itself has given us sufficient space to, to, to build a footprint or, or a base upon which we can further increase the economic value of, of the company. We have gone through an internal process as well. I mean, I've given you some idea of the external interventions we've made, but we've made a number of significant internal in interventions as well. We've restructured the organization. We've cut out a lot of the fat in the organization. We've looked at the operational efficiencies within the environment. And this has translated directly into huge amounts of cost savings, okay? Because one of the big things was that we did not want Tenel to continue to be a drain on the fiscus and the economy of this country. And I believe that we have gone a long way towards bringing our part to the table to ensure that in partnership with government, National Treasury, the Department of Public Enterprises, Department of Defense, that we will no longer be the kind of burden that we have been on the state over the last few years.